Yo, welcome to the Serious About Rugby League betting preview for the 2015 Ladbrokes Challenge Cup Final. Uh, our usual tips to Paul Redhead is on holiday at the moment, so I, I will be doing the tips for the big game. The first thing I'm going to look at is a handicap betting. Hull KR are getting 14 start. Uh, I'm going to back Leeds to cover that, I think. At evens, they, um, they're in terrific form. There's no two ways about it. They've got... A fantastic backline and the big pitch at Wembley, it's uh, expected to be a dry day. Like to Callum Watkins and Zach Hardacre, uh, they're given any sort of space by all KR, they'll run riot. So I'm going to back the Rhinos to cover that, I think, at evens. Um, the match bet in itself, all KR are 4 to 1. I'm sure a few Rovers fans will fancy that price. Um, There's winning margin bets that obviously very popular I tend to avoid them but if I was to pick one out I'd probably go for Leeds to win by 16 to 20 points that's at 11 to 2 which is a good price for me um, moving on to the try scorer market there's uh, some interesting first try scorer odds I particularly like both fullbacks Zach Hardacre Kieran Dixon both brilliant attacking players Hardacre is 11 to 1 he's been in great form and Dixon, he's got electric speed. He uh, he can find a gap out and off, and he's 16 to 1, which, which I feel is a great price. Um, the anytime try score odds, if I were to pick two players out at good odds, I think um, Carl Ablett, he's obviously one of uh, Paul's favourites for anytime try betting. He's 9 to 4. And so is Sean Lump for all care, obviously a former Leeds player. I'd fancy him to get a try at some point in the game at 9 to 4. That's decent odds. Um, William Hill are actually doing some special bets on the game. There's a two which I really like, which is Ryan Hall to score and Leeds to lift the trophy, thirteen to ten. Now, I wouldn't say it's a banker, but I like I do like the look of that. And the other bet they're offering is Hall to score at any time, Watkins to score at any time, for both of them to score at any time. Oh, sorry, for both of them to score a try in the game, it's ten to three, which is good odds for that. Uh, and finally, man of the match betting. Kevin Simfield and Jamie Peacock, obviously all eyes will be on them too. Um, if I was to pick one out of the two, that would have to be Simfield. He's likely to start the game at hooker by the looks of it, but he'll still play a, a big role in the game. When Rob Burrow comes on, he's likely to go into the halves. His kicking game was brilliant in last year's final, and I fancy it'll be the same again in this. I think he control, can control the game. His odds are 7 to 2, which aren't the greatest, but if I'm honest, it's written in the script for him to win man of the match, so I'd have to go with him on the lead side. As for Hull KR, you've got to look at Albert Kelly. He's sat four weeks on the sideline since the semi final victory. He's had a lot of time to prepare, obviously, recovering from injury, but if he's 100% and he plays his best and Hull KR can get, to get the win, then. I think Albert Kelly will be the man of the match for Hulkington Rovers. Um, thanks for listening. As always, gamble responsibly. And if you're going down to Wembley or even if you're watching on TV, enjoy the game. Cheers.